So this weekend, uh, want to have some very cold temperatures. We're looking at freezing temperatures Friday morning and below freezing temperatures Saturday morning. And we've got a lot of beans that look like these guys right here. I've gotten a lot of phone calls today on whether or not the freeze is going to kill the beans. And frost is kind of funny. It kind of depends on whether it's conventional till, no-till, crop residue, cover crop, all those different dynamics in the field. But at the end of the day, the freeze or the frost can take the cotyledons off the plant here. Or it can even take this unifoliate off, or if they're even big enough to have the first trifoliate, it can freeze all this plant tissue off here and these cotyledons. But what it comes down to is whether or not it gets the auxiliary buds that are tucked right up in here underneath the plant. You can just barely see that one there. And when we look at frost damage on soybeans, we can lose all this green material here, but as long as the auxiliary buds here and the unifoliate and down here under the cotyledon survive, because they're tucked up close to the stem, in two weeks time, these things will take right back off. It'll be a little shorter and a little bushier than what the original plant would be, but as long as those buds tucked way down in there survive the cold there he is way down in there then these soybeans will be all right so uh everybody wants an answer right away there's whoop, there's a better look down there if i can focus you can see that auxiliary bud right there if they survive the freeze they'll look ugly 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 for two weeks and then they'll be right back and, and be nice bushy branchy beans um, but if it kills the plant down to here and all the buds above it this is the soil line if it smokes the plant down the soil line and kills these extra buds then that's game over and then we start talking about replant so i guess stay tuned we'll see how cold it gets